Hi everybody, Patrick here from Engineering Shop Electronics. Uh, this is the Project 6 video for the EPIC Learning Center. This project is called Analog Inputs, Integers, and the Serial Monitor. Um, it's a beginner level um, program. It's very easy. There's very little setup to do. Uh, the code is available on the project page linked below. The Kickstarter is uh, live. And what we have here is one cable connecting the light sensor to the uh, analog pin 3. And uh, I'll give you, I'll zoom in on that so you can have a better look. So this is the A3 pin. You can see the labeling on the board. You can't see it from the same, uh, this angle, but we got A0, A1, A2, A3, A4, and A5. So we're going to use A3. And it's connected to the light pin. Just above it is L couple, uh, which is light couple. It's, uh, we'll use that later on when we want to make a laser trip wire. But this is the light dependent resistor. It's um, an LDR. And what it does is it changes resistance based on how much light it sees. Typically, um, you see much more resistance when it's dark and uh, much lower resistance uh, when it's bright. And it's just in series with a resistor. It's a very, very a fixed resistor. It's very simple. At the end of this campaign, if the campaign is funded, uh, I will go over all of the schematics on the Epic. So this is all we need to do to set up for our approach for this specific project. And once we've loaded uh, project number six, uh, into the board, uh, we want to open up our serial monitor. Now the code is fully uh, f fully commented and these videos serve specifically to show you how to hook up and run the program. If you want to learn more about the uh, the program, please have a look at the uh, fully commented code at the pro project page below. Once you've programmed your EPIC, you've verified it, you've uploaded it successfully, go, open the, go to the tools menu and go down Right now we're connected to port 5. Make sure that you're connected to the proper USB port. And I'm going to go to Serial Monitor. And I'm going to zoom in on this. As soon as I hit the Serial Monitor, it resets the Arduino program and starts from scratch. So in this program, we programmed it to print every half second uh, the light sensor output. Currently we're seeing about half of the full scale voltage. Uh, 5 volts would equal 1023 and 0 volts would equal a value of 0. We're seeing about 530 on average. So if I put my hand over the light sensor, those values are going to change. As you can see, it's now it's closer to 5 volts. Um, and if I, if I um, shine bright light on it, I don't have a very bright light in front of me, but if I shine a bright light on it, uh, we'll see a much, a much larger or a much smaller voltage. And so what I'll do is I'll actually turn on, I do have a relatively bright light here. There we go. Now it's gone all the way down to about 50. Now this has to, this, there's a relationship here between the single fixed resistor and the light dependent resistor. And again, that'll be covered in an electronic uh, analysis video. But this video serves specifically to show you how to run the program. Very simple program. Uh, and the code obviously uh, is fully commented so you can follow along and learn from it. Thanks for watching everyone. Uh, stay tuned for Project 7.